Welcome to your Isikosa lessons with Golping Mumba. <laughs> Welcome back to your Isikosa lessons. Today's word is Obulongwe. Obulongwe. Now, Obulongwe is a glamorous interior designing substance, crucially important in the cleanliness and neatness of a traditional Kosa household. Now, most commonly used to clean and freshen the floor of a hut, which is also known and referred to as Ungupansi, Oronda, Orondaul, Oround, etc. Obulongwe may be seen and known as Ikakayengomo generally, but to the great tribe of the Kosa people, it is a natural, impeccable design, interior design element that nature provides. Natural, but Obulongwe is only produced and excreted by cows through a digestive functionality known as taking a shit, Utoa in simpler terms. Obulongwe has a wide range of various uses within the Kosa culture. For example, Abelusi Kadesio Etipin, Si Etipin, Abelusi, Ekseni, Kubanda, Bayakwazo Fakinyao, Ebulongwe Yonobusando Kakwa and Gomo, Bususu. Ususugeze inyao, kwezo ngele, ke mtaka bao za ngenzeni, kumatafa na kwenzi ime kutandwa kuzo, kakio tichwa imfuyo. Now those who know that, just know. <laughs> Not to be confused with other kinds of animal kak, like ingatane or itela. Obulongwe can be exclusively used for usinda. Now usinda is a closer process of cleaning that includes spreading the cow dung all over the floor using your bare hands. Now, Obulongwe experts will even use this magnificent creation on their stoop, veranda, and around the lower inner and outer door frames. It looks and smells amazing. You should try it. It's pronounced U Bu Lo Ngwe U. Bu lo ngwe. One more time. U bu lo ngwe. That's your easy closer lesson for today. Peace out.